been a day. I got back my first proof copy of A Cozy Den. It's the first thing that I've kind of laid out and printed on my own and it is not good. <laughs> Allow me to show you what has happened. See this? Despite the fact that I set like all of the margins and bleed to exactly what the printer wanted and needed in Scribus, save the PDF, all of this nonsense. Like, this has been quite a challenge. Basically, I like, have laid out a PDF in this program called Lucid Press and that couldn't save embedded fonts and so I had to download Scribus which I have an Ubuntu computer so I have to like look up the Linux code put that in like download it learn how to use this program because it is not as easy as either InDesign or Lucid Presses and it like doesn't function half the time relay out the entire thing you know change all the fonts because they weren't in the same fonts weren't in scribus as were in lucid press and you know basically finagle all of this try to get all the right margins all the right bleed sent it off multiple times to drive through rpg in order to print it and you know finally go back and forth with customer service finally get something printed get it sent to me like it takes a week to print so this has been a month and a half process now and you know I finally get the print copy back the proof you know before I order a hundred of them or whatever because I want to sell them um, through a couple different places at conventions I get the proof back and here it is like for whatever reason the margins and the bleed are not what I save them as so blah 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 you know I get the print proof back you know that's why you order a proof it's pretty common to have this type of problem with printing but it was so disheartening I like spent all that time and energy on it and I need to have it done by origins like I need to have things delivered to me within a month and this is a huge setback you know and I'm, I was just like so sad and it really stalled my productivity because I had to process this, like this feeling of failing at doing a thing, you know, failing at the layout or getting it proof, a proof made to begin with, you know, am I going to have the ability to get it done in time? So suddenly added stress and worry and, you know, just the cost of it. I mean, it's $12 a proof, which doesn't sound like a lot, but it is for me right now because I'm pretty broke. So all those things make, got me kind of down. You know, I was pretty bummed out. I had a beer. But that's just a part of the process, you know? Like, so many times during creative endeavors and game design and in printing, blah, 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 you know, I fail. And sometimes with something like this, when it takes a lot of time and effort and it fails, it just feels worse. And so, yeah, I don't know. I don't really have coping mechanisms for it, really. The best coping mechanism is just to feel those feelings of sadness, realize that this is a small obstacle in the long run, you know, find solutions and sit down and start working on it again, which in a lot of ways is a huge bummer because I already put in all of that work and it just didn't pay out. So yeah, this is just like a, a brief chat on feeling like you failed because I felt like I failed yesterday and just kind of learning to process that and, you know, get back to it because it's part of the process and you know you're gonna have feelings and that's okay and you know you just gotta feel them and then just keep working just keep doing it it's part of it 
So yeah, if you ever hit a wall like that or feel like a failure, it's okay. I guess is what I'm trying to say. It happens to me all the time. It sucks, but I'm already doing a little bit better today. I've already got it relayed out and um, sent it back in, even though there were some more error issues. So hopefully this time it'll work. Failure, it sucks, but it's part of the creative process by Akira McGran. Thanks so much for watching. Please uh, like and subscribe, share with your friends. If you found this valuable um, in any way, and uh, I don't know, have you, had, have you had a creative failure like this recently? Like, what, do, what are your coping mechanisms for a setback or a, a challenge like this? I would love to know in the comments. I hope you liked this outdoor edition in my backyard.